Well, there it is. Right now, hundreds of people are strapping on their running shoes to help some of Jacksonville's youngest patients. The ninth annual Wolfs and Children's Hospital Challenge is underway at the baseball grounds downtown, and that's where we find First Coast News' Stephanie Kim. She's live with more as the race kicks off. Hey, Stephanie, how's it going? Hey, good morning, Shelby. It's such an exciting time here. Now, this event is benefiting 55 of some of our city's youngest patients at Wolfson Children's yeah. Hospital. And with me now is Joanna Blinn with the event. I thank so much for joining us. Good morning. morning. Thank you. So this is the ninth year that this has been going on. Yes. Tell us a little bit about it. So it's our ninth year celebrating the patients of Wolfson Children's Hospital and our amazing community and clinical staff. We have more than 2,000 runners out here today, and we are raising money for Wolfson Children's Hospital. The money this year is being designated to our trauma and emergency department, um, and the 55 kids that are here today are representatives of all the patients that Wolfson serves. And talk about the wide range of, you know, diseases and, uh, you know, the fight for these kids. Uh, what are they going through? So our 55 kids that, that are selected every year by their clinicians um, represent all areas of the hospital. So it can be everybody from the emergency department or kids that are battling cancer, kids that are medically complex and have lifelong issues. Um, and so we get everybody from our hospital to nominate these kids. We have a wide range of ages too, and we have them from all over. We have some from Tallahassee, um, South Georgia, and so they represent the thousands of kids that we serve. Um, and they're all here with their families today to celebrate with us. You know, having 2,000 runners, how how much money do you guys hope to raise through an event like this? Every year we raise around $300,000. That's usually our goal. And all of that money right now is being matched by Baptist Health. So um, it doubles the impact and uh, doubles what we're able to do at the hospital. All right, final question. If people aren't able to make it out to the run this morning, how can they also help out? They can go to our website at wolfsonchildrenschallenge.com and make a donation. They can also go to our Facebook. We have many Facebook fundraisers raising money for the hospital. Uh, and always you can come out today and join us if you can. Joanna, thank you so much. Great event for a great cause. Uh, and coming up, we'll be here throughout the morning to introduce you to some of these kids that are benefiting from this event. Reporting live downtown, Stephanie Kim, First Coast News, on your side.